Hi, this is Rhiannon and I'm going to show you today how to register with Digivol and just a bit of navigation around um, the website. So first of all you need to go to volunteer.ala.org.au and click on the login tab up the top. This will take you to the sign in page. You can either sign in with Facebook or Twitter or Google or you can, if you don't have an account, you can sign up down the bottom here with the sign up now button. Once you've clicked on that, you can create your account by filling in this form. The primary usage and secondary usage, you can just type in volunteer there and then click on create account. Once you've done this, it will send you an email and just to verify your email address. So let's just go back to our front page. Once you've verified your email address, you can log in. Put in your put in your email address and your password. I can't remember it. and then click on the login. So you're now logged into Digivol. Now up the top here is a whole range of different things that you can access from the front page. First of all, I'll just talk about the home page. You can join an expedition from the home page. You can go to collect labels, collection labels. You can go to field journals or you can go to camera traps or you can scroll down to see all the expeditions that are on Digivol. You can also see the Digivol stats, the honor board and also latest contributions. So these are the different expeditions that are available on Digivol. We'll come back later. We'll first, first of all, we'll go up the top here to our institutions tab. Now, if you only want to work on projects for a particular institution, this is where you would go. You would choose your institution page to go to. And all the expeditions that are associated with that institution will be on this front page. There's also an expeditions tab at the top. And that has all the expeditions that are on Digivolt, even the ones that are completed. For example, this one here, you can see that's 100% transcribed. Going along here, we have a tutorials tab, and we have all the tutorials that are on Digivolt. Now, most of, once you go into an expedition front, front page, there will be a tutorials button, so it if you click on that, it will take you to the tutorial that's associated with that expedition. Uh, we'll, I'll show you that in, in a minute. We'll go along to the forum tab. This is where you can ask questions from other volunteers or from myself. Um, and other volunteers or myself will answer the questions. We have a contact us page. Just the digivol at osmus.gov.au website. I mean, email address. There's also the My Profile. Now this is where you can view your profile, any changes that you want to do, so update, updating your profile, resetting your password, these kind of things can be accessed from here. You can also access your notebook from the My Profile tab. Now your notebook shows you when you first started with Digivol, how many contributions you have made, how many transcriptions you have done, what contribution to research in this graph over here. It also has these tabs down here, your transcribed tasks, if you've saved any tasks or if you've gone onto the forum. So let's just join an expedition. 
I'm going to choose our fly expedition here. Once you click on the icon, there will be a get started button, but there's also a view tutorial button. So if you view the tutorial, it will take you to the tutorial that's associated with that particular expedition. And if you click on the get started, it will take you to a task. And we will show you how to transcribe a task in further tutorials.